This is Andy Purawa for Boxing News. I'm joined by the surgeon, Benzo, slightly blinded. <laughs> ben Whitaker. Now, ben, now you need your you, yeah. yeah, no. <laughs> ben, you delivered a knockout. You entertained the fans. You're slightly blinded now, but you're going to have to uh, grin and bear it. But yeah, talking about what it felt like stepping back between those ropes tonight after such a long wait. Yeah, it was good. I was telling my team it's a bit weird, obviously, putting the gloves on again, skipping, warming up. And that's why I wanted to just go through the motion, have a little dance, look at the crowd, take it all in. First fight at home since I was probably about 16, 15, so I really enjoyed it. But at the end of the day, we had to get the job done, and I did. How much does tonight, being back after oh. such a long time? This ain't alcohol as well, it's a fruit punch, do you know what I mean, fruit punch. I'll take your word for that, Ben. I heard you asking about an after party earlier. I'm working, so I can't trust you. No, I don't drink, man. I'm a 100% athlete, but carry on. Uh, you're still moving there, uh, Ben. Still got a little jiggle on. We saw you with a, a Naz-inspired ring walk as well. Walk me through that. Yeah, I just got signed by Adidas. Um, a lot of people keep saying I've got glimpses of Naz. I haven't actually watched him too much, but uh, for this fight, let me look into him. My favourite fight of him was the Kevin Kelly one, I think it was. So I thought, yeah, I'm going to do that one. And it worked out. Listen, you're flashy, you're showboaty. Some people are like it, some people obviously be critical of it. But at the end of the day, we know how talented you are. You showed it in there tonight. How would you assess your performance? Walk me through those two and a very brief third round. Yeah, it's one of those. Um, I could have easily got him out there earlier. Um, as soon as I threw the first jab and his eyes swelled up, I said, yeah, I've got him. Then I got a bit carried away looking at the crowd having fun, but that's just me. Uh, that's the kid still in me, but when I need to knuckle down and hurt somebody, I showed I can do that too. That's what everybody wants to see now, kind of the progression. We saw him there tonight. It was great to see you back, but there's levels to yourself and Jordan Grant. The next step up, talks about the type of opposition you want in there. I don't really know. Like Even this one, um, I don't actually look at my opponent like that. I let Will Harvey and the rest of my team do it. They just said, Jordan Grant, uh, May 6th, he said yes. I said, all right, then. <laughs> and that was it, do you know what I mean? And uh, here we are. I just heard he was a tough kid. He took someone 10 rounds or something, but we got him out there in free. You had Dan Aziz there ringside. I don't know what his comments might have been, but if you <laughs> you got a little smirk there, do you know what Dan Aziz had to say or anything? No, no, we're, at the end of the day, like I said, we both fight. So we, sp uh, we spoke on the little interview thing and he congratulated me. I said, thank you very much. And if the pass crossed, he eventually crossed, but uh, we both got respect there too. Did he say what he thought of your performance? I know he liked it, man. I saw the glisten in his eye. He thought, I don't want a piece of him. Do you know what I mean? So, but cool guy, cool guy. Just so for a final one on that note, kind of how good did it feel just to get a victory back under your belt, try and build some momentum now, moving into the rest of this year? Yeah, that's the main thing for me. Like I said, uh, I always want to keep putting on more performances like this, more activity, more rounds in the bank, and more knockouts in the bank. That's what I want. I know you're a Wolverhampton boy, Ben, obviously Birmingham's, you won't really see Wolverhampton become a hot spot for big shows to return, but Birmingham certainly can be. Do you feel like you could be the man to deliver that? 100%. Uh, Midlands, West Midlands is my home. If, if it's West Brom, if it's Wolverhampton, if it's Birmingham. And tonight was Birmingham and I loved it. And hopefully, keep putting on performances like this, we can get bigger nights back here. And hopefully, I'm not so low in the card, I'm the headline. <laughs> well, Ben, when do we talk about my little cut for introducing you and Sugar? I know i got to thank you, man. You put the little feeler out there. Sugar looked into me and he liked me and I'm knocking kids out now. You can thank me with some of them O's on your deal. I'll give you some of my fruit punch juice. <laughs> hey, listen, you're saying it's juice though. I don't know about that, but listen, Ben, it's always a pleasure. Enjoy your night. How are you going to celebrate? Um, go home, see my mum. Um, probably watch a bit of anime. Wake up tomorrow, it's another day, man. It's just what I'm supposed to do. Listen, Ben, it's a pleasure as always. Thanks for speaking to me. Enjoy this night. Thank you very much.